Chesapeake firefighters are hitting the streets this week for a great cause. It's time to fill the boot for MDA. And here now to tell us more are Lieutenants Chris Moore from Engine 14 and Brian Evers from Engine 2. Welcome to the Hampton Road Show, guys. Thank you. Greg. Filling the boot for MDA. Okay, Brian, we'll start with you. Tell us what this is all about. Well, this is uh, right now we're doing the 60th anniversary uh, with a partnership with the uh, International Association of Firefighters and the Muscular Dystrophy Association. Uh, 1954 is when the first fill the boot actually started from um, Boston uh, Fire Lieutenant up in Boston Fire Department. I actually did a uh, fill the boot for a friend of his that his uh, kids had uh, descent muscular dystrophy. And it went from that on all the way for 60 years now. And we are actually the partners. We raised more money than any other organization for muscular dystrophy. Wow. Um, That's so really saying something. $26 million was raised by firefighters alone last year. Now it's Chesapeake's turn. Chris, uh, tell me, you guys at uh, Engine 14 and all the other uh, engines around the state, uh, the city of Chesapeake, what will you guys be doing this week in it? Uh, practice and safety. Exactly. Safety first. Right. We're going to be out in the intersections all across the, uh, the city of Chesapeake, hitting the major intersections. Uh, we're going to be raising funds to support the Fill the Boot. It starts this Friday. Mm -hmm. It's uh, Friday the 15th, Saturday the 16th, and Sunday the 17th. Then we'll be back out there again the following Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, 22nd, 23rd, 24th. What are you guys asking of people out there? Uh, change, cash, anything that they can come up with. A lot of people uh, apologize to us and uh, that all they have is uh, some change. It all adds up. It mm -hmm. all goes to a great cause. If they don't see us out there in the intersections, because we are doing it on duty, and we are running calls in the meanwhile. If they miss us, they can stop by any Chesapeake fire station, make donations. This really does make a difference. Uh, Lieutenant Evers, you have a child grown up with a spinal muscular uh, um, atrophy. Tell us about that and how that might have helped. The, well, the um, well, Kendall, she was uh, 11 months old when she was diagnosed with spinal muscular atrophy type 2. Mm -hmm. um, and at the time of her diagnosis, they said the, the oldest that she would live are probably 13 or 14 years old. Um, she's 25 today. She's actually getting married next month. Congratulations. So, That's uh, awesome. But if it wasn't for uh, muscular dystrophy and the firefighters uh, raising this amount of money to actually do, have a medical equipment and surgeries and things that, that prolonged her life. So um, it that's, does make that's, a difference. Yeah, it makes a big difference. And, and Chris, you guys also have a firefighter who is uh, suffering with Lou Gehrig's disease. Yes, sir. This might be able to help him or others maybe in the future? It helps everybody. There's in this region here, there's uh, 2,800 families that are, get support from the MDA in uh, the, uh, the Virginia area here. So all the money that we raise, uh, the firefighters raise here, uh, the most, uh, most of it stays locally here, and then a, a small portion of it goes to uh, national research, but it helps these 2,800 families in this region. Well, we want to thank you guys for the work that you do for the city of Chesapeake, keeping the citizens safe. Great job. You look great today, by the way, guys. Love the outfit. Don't forget, Chesapeake Fire Department. Fill the boot for MDA. Make donations at any Chesapeake Fire Station or visit IAFF. Give them a call at, two, well, actually online, 2449.org. Don't forget, fill the boot this weekend. Any change you got, help the guys out. Great job, guys. Thank, thank you, Chris. Thanks, Chris. Appreciate, Appreciate it, it. boy. Appreciate it.